Thank you for choosing the Garmin Mark Aviator Gen 2 Modern Tool Watch. This video will guide you through setting up your new watch. First, press and hold the light button on the top left to power on your watch. When ready, press the start stop button on the upper right of the watch to begin. Use the up and down buttons on the left side of the watch to scroll through the language options. Press the start stop button to select your language. Next, we'll pair your compatible smartphone with your watch. Select yes to begin. If you already have the Garmin Connect app installed, go ahead and open it. Otherwise, you will now need to download the Garmin Connect app on your compatible smartphone. In this video, we will be using an Apple iPhone, but the process is similar on Android devices. Once the download is complete, open the Garmin Connect app. Select Sign In if you already have a Garmin Connect account, or select Create a New Account. Follow the on-screen instructions to enter your information. For customers already signed in to their Garmin Connect account and are using an Apple device, press More on the bottom right to open settings. Android customers will select the menu icon in the top left. Once in settings, select Garmin Devices, followed by Add Device. For new or existing customers, select Connect It when the app recognizes your watch. Your watch will automatically associate the code displayed on the watch in the Garmin Connect app. If not, enter the code into the Garmin Connect app, then select Pair. Next, follow the on-screen prompts to set up your user preferences. To complete the app setup, select Finish. The app will offer to guide you through enabling key features and services. You can choose to proceed with the app or dismiss. The watch will now prompt you to enter an alternate time zone. Select Use Airport Identifier to enter the alphanumeric identifier for an aviation waypoint. When using the watch keyboard, you may even use the Garmin Connect app as the keyboard to speed up the entry. If you do not have an airport identifier, just select Use Map to search for a time zone. Once selected, you can now rename the zone or select the X to dismiss. Repeat this process for the second alternate time zone. Now that your watch and phone are paired, your watch will display the watch face with the date and time. The default watch face is specific to your Mark Edition, but it can be customized to show data that is important to you. See our Customizing the Watch Face video to learn more. As you first start using the watch, helpful tips will display, enabling you to learn more about your watch. Now, we would recommend you fully charge the watch before heading out on your adventure. Pro tip, for longer adventures, you can always keep your charging cable handy to charge up on the go. You can even use a UL certified power bank, or if your compatible smartphone supports reverse charging, connect directly to the device to charge your smartwatch. Your Mark also includes a touchscreen that you can use to operate the watch. For example, you can tap on the screen to enable the backlight. Swiping up or down allows you to scroll through pages. Tap an option to select it. Swiping right will take you back. Covering the screen with your palm will return to the watch face and disable the backlight. To learn more about using your touchscreen, see the owner's manual at www.support.garmin.com. Your Mark Edition is custom tailored to your flying passion and includes a hotkey to quickly access navigation to an aviation waypoint. To open the hotkey, press and hold the start stop button. See our Customizing the Controls and Hotkeys video to learn more about available hotkeys. To get to your activity list, press the start stop button. By default, your Mark Edition will have a preset activity list that mirrors your passion. However, by selecting Add at the bottom of the list, you can add more activities. Simply scroll through the list and select the activity you want to add by pressing the Start Stop button. 
Next, confirm where you want to place it on your list. Then repeat this process to add other activities. To open an activity, press the Start Stop button. And that's it. Your Garmin Mark Aviator Gen 2 is now set up. To learn more about your watch, please see our other videos or visit support.garmin.com.